Hello, my name is Nate Morris. My life before Christ, um, you know, I always believed in God, but I was, what you could say, just riding through the motions. Um, I went to church when I was younger with my mom, but I was really young. I just kind of went and, you know, made the best of it, went on. Um, I did go to church a little bit whenever Ashley and I uh, were married. Um, didn't really care for it, and I believe just because I wasn't, I wasn't really invested into it. You know, I was more about, I got to get home to watch the Chiefs play. You know, I, I you know, it's uh, church is great, but you know, I, I didn't have my priorities straight. I, you know, felt kind of selfish like that. Um, you know, we met uh, Rob and Jen. They invited us back, and I was hesitant at first, but then I said, well, I'm going to go back. I'm going to give it a try, and just really loved it. Um, and I started investing more into it, and that's what made me want to grow and get more knowledge about it. Um, you know, just getting into the Bible and learning a little bit here and there, really relating it to life, your life. Um, it hit me one day. I, I kept saying, I'm ready. I'm ready. I want to I wanna turn my life over to Jesus. And I just never could work up the courage to go up to the front. And I was like, I don't want to walk in front of the people. I'd be really embarrassed. Um, so when they were taking Lord's Supper, Nick said, I'm going to be over here. Carson's going to be over there. If you, you know, if you feel like you need to turn your life over, turn your life over. And I'm like, well, God set it up for me. He, he did the hard part. So I, I approached Nick. And honestly, it was, it was probably one of the best days of my life, um, you know, that was whenever I feel like I became a Christian. Um, I, I put God first now. Um, I always knew that Jesus died on the cross, but I didn't really know what that represented uh, to know that he died on the cross for our sins and that you don't have to be perfect, that we're all sinners. That was the best thing. I, that's what worried me a lot too, because I thought, I'm gonna have to change a lot. I'm gonna have to do this and do that. But you know, it changes you. It really does. It does change you. It's it's great. Um, life after turning your life over to Jesus has been great. I I don't worry as much. Uh, I feel like that. I want to be in the Bible more. I want to learn more um, related to life a lot, and it it just really has made my life a lot better. Um, I want to pray more. I, I, you know, I want to be in the Bible and I want to learn every day. Um, I do fail, but it's, you know, it's, it's nice to know that we're all that we're all sinners and we just have to, you know, turn away from our sins and repent from them and uh, you know ask for forgiveness. And you know, our our God is glorious like that, and that's that's the best part about it. And just. Being baptized, you know, it, it doesn't save you, but it's just, it's just your commitment. It's, uh, it's, it's my accountability. That's why I want to do it. I, I do struggle with things, but this, you know, baptism is really, is, it's really the, the first, the first step. And I, you know, like I said, it, it won't save you from everything, but, um, you know, being a church member, being committed to God, putting God first, um, knowing Jesus died on the cross for you. Uh, that's that's what it's all about. I just I encourage everybody today. If you have not turned to Jesus, please do because your life will be so much better. And just take it from me. I I know mine is. It really is. And um, it it's just great. God's good. Jesus is great. And uh, I'm just really looking forward to this opportunity.